Hi guys, Heidi Cooper here, functional medicine practitioner, licensed esthetician from Skin Side Out. So you know I often share information about hormonal imbalances and the connection with skin because it's a lot of what I see in my practice. So today I wanted to share nine symptoms, signs and symptoms of low progesterone. And this is something that I'm seeing happen at all different age ranges anymore. So. Um, this is something if if you're dealing with some of these symptoms, then it might be worth doing a little deeper dive into testing hormones and seeing what's going on there to, so that that can be addressed. So number one on the list is if you're gaining weight, especially around the middle, that can be a sign. Number two is you're experiencing headaches um, that are persistent, a lot of migraines, that sort of thing. Number two. Number three, you've got mood swings, including anxiety and depression. And number three is your sex drive is low. Number four is you're having lots of hot flashes and night sweats. If that's something that's starting to happen with you, that can be really problematic. And then number six is you have trouble sleeping and you feel fatigued all day long. I've definitely dealt with this myself before. So that insomnia and then being super tired during the, the day is not any fun. And then number seven is your joints ache and you're just less flexible. You're just noticing that you've got a lot of achiness going on and lack of flexibility. And number eight is adult onset acne. So this is something that many years ago I started to see in my practice that was really perplexing to me is these women that had no um, breakout issues necessarily as, as they were a teenager, but now they're now in their 20s and an adult and all of a sudden, and now it's even happening a little bit earlier, even like late teens, um, they may be going to college and never had that when they were younger and then all of a sudden some of this acne breakout is going on. So that can be a real sign there as well. And then number nine is the menstrual cycle is not regular. Although I will tell you, there have been a lot of instances um, in dealing with clients where actually the, the cycle still is regular, but there are um, there is there is some hormonal imbalance there as well. And that's number nine. So hope that was some helpful information for you. If it was, um, please like and share this video with someone that you know that would benefit from it. And um, if you've got any questions, please feel free to reach out. Health and happiness. Have a super fantastic day. Thanks so much.